African Americans are more likely to borrow money to go to college, borrow more money while they're in college, and have a harder time paying that debt off after they get out. Today in America, a new study came out 20 years out. Whites who borrowed money, 94% of them have paid off their student loan debt. 5% of African Americans have paid it off. I believe that means everyone on this stage should be embracing student loan debt forgiveness. It will help close the black-white wealth gap. Let's do something tangible and real to make change in this country. Everyone on this stage should help close that gap. Well, in the years since, Senator Elizabeth Warren has worked to ensure that President Biden would do just that. We know that she was pushing the White House on the issue as recently as Friday, when she, along with Senators Chuck Schumer and Raphael Warnock, met with White House Chief of Staff Ron Klain. And then came today's monumentous, much-anticipated announcement. The White House says Biden's plan will fully cancel the debt of 45 percent of borrowers, and 90 percent of the relief will go to those earning less than $75,000. Now, the plan is already facing predictable criticism on the right. Republicans say it goes too far, and then it leaves the check with those who did not go to college or have already managed to pay off their debt, and that it could also add to inflation. The people who are being helped here, 42 percent of them don't even have a college diploma. These are not people who went to Harvard the way that Tom Cotton did. <laughs> These are people who have been scratching it out at state schools, at historically black colleges and universities. They have had to borrow money to get there. They've had to borrow money to stay there. And they've had the hardest time paying off their debts on the other side. And what's happening to those folks right now? They can't move out of mom's basement. They can't save up money to, to buy a home. They can't start a small business. Heck, a lot of them can't even start a family. They not only help themselves, they help build the economy for all of us. Economists will tell you, following World War II, when the returning GIs yeah. got the GI Bill benefits, that it not only helped them that it returned to the American economy money many fold over what we invested. Why? Because it helped make us a richer nation overall. That's the first step that the president and the Democrats have taken today. And the Republicans, what if they got to answer that with nothing? They Goose got egg. nothing. They <laughs> are the party of no. They got no ideas. They got nothing. So they're going to try a little their version of class warfare. Well, let the Harvard boys try it. It's Ooh. not going to work. Burn.